As a measure of last resort, the mayor of Port of Spain, Karen Valentine, is making public his appeal to the Water and Sewerage Authority to regularize their supply to the capital city. He says the call comes after months of frustration and pleading with Wasa, cries which all seem to have fallen on deaf ears. Efforts to contact uh, those at Wasa has not been too forthcoming and too favorable, but we we are of the view that our Burgesses, our constituents, have paramount importance to us, and we are really seeking to highlight and to call on the Water and Sewage Authority to please intervene with immediate effect. Mr. Valentine said uh, the authority's disregard for the city has manifested in more ways than one. Another problem, he says, they grapple with is poor roadways. A problem, he said, traces back to Wasser. The root of the cause is when you would see the majority of potholes and, and, and gaping manholes, etc., when our workers go out to actually remedy the job, we realize that below the surface, it's a broken or leaking water main. And efforts again to contact WASA to have speedy recovery of it is not forthcoming. The councillor for the St. Anne's River North area took his complaint a bit further, calling for an audit to be done into the authority. He questioned whether the issue is as a result of favoritism. Water is inadequately supplied to the Port of Spain area, the Laventil area. It, 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 it really borders on inequality and inequity. He noted that committee meetings have been used to facilitate past conversations with WASA, but warned that if all efforts prove futile, the matter will be taken directly to the Minister of Public Utilities, Ansel Antoine.